Hi Leo, welcome to my channel. This is a love romantic relationship reading for you, Leo. I hope you're okay. I hope you're well. This reading for today, Leo, is for the month of July. This is applicable for singles only. In today's reading, guys, I'm going to be delivering two messages, intuitive message for you. One reading is who's coming towards you from the past. And one reading is who's coming towards you, brand new love. All right? So if you're manifesting from uh, manifesting someone from the past, this is part one. This is this reading. Okay? So who's coming towards you from the past? Connecting, reconnecting for Leo Friends July month. Okay, let's have a look at it, Leo. Okay, this could be an Aquarius. This could be an Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Capricorn, Taurus, or a Virgo. For some of you, this could be a Sagittarius specifically and a Leo, a Taurus again, okay? So who's coming towards you from the past July month, singles, Leo? It could be um, someone who communicated last um, April or May or Feb, March, April, nine weeks ago, okay? Nine weeks ago, eight weeks ago, number eight, number nine, if that is significant. And then two, two of ones in reverse. For some of you, this person, they had a detour. They had a plan to travel. It didn't happen because probably of a delay, a pandemic, but they had a detour, okay? A detour. And two of pentacles, they are now paying attention with you. This person, they recently break up or when you were dating or getting to know, it was an overlap. Because this is them. They're finally over with the person in the past. Or they're over with the issue, the pain, the struggle, or the inconsistency you have from this person in the past. Because this is them. They've completed the cycle. They're coming very light energy, positive energy. So I'd suggest whoever is connecting to you, Leo, from the past, don't bring up old issues, old pain. Just go with the flow. Um, enjoy the friendship and then accept the friendship if you like this person and start all over again. Because this is them, okay? This is your person. They've completed this cycle. The, the cycle is it connected to you for some of you guys or the cycle is connected to a person they dated or break up but part of their journey or pain or hurt you were you were you were there but their energy is and their aura is really completed the shift something like that sorry so it's really good so they they're done with the past could be they're done with something negative in the past they're looking at that and they feel like they graduated from this and they're making sure that they will prioritize love and you okay so their focus is on you so when this person connect reconnect don't try to bring old energy from the past old issues just start all over again let's you start with um start as friends okay and unload the baggages because i really feel like a very light um, light light um a very positive energy it's it's very upbeat and um it's 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 an energy or it's a message where um it's a feeling leo where i believe leo will accept me my mistake and will forgive me okay so if they feel like leo you're gonna growl at them or you're gonna bring old issues old pain all hurt you know, hurt and stuff like that and their inconsistencies, they won't be motivated. They won't be encouraged to proceed, okay, or to, to connect with you in a romantic way because who who would want to be, you know, surrounded or be with a person who always criticize their negativity, okay, or whatever pain or hurt they, uh, they exhibit in the past. So they want to be, they don't want to be judged. They want to come forward clean slate, okay? So... If you like this person, interested with this person, you look at this person as a brand new love. Forget about the past and for, forget, forgive. Not easy to, you know, not, it's easy to say for me because I'm not been hurt. But I felt like their energy is really upbeat, light, and they have unload the baggage. Okay? So this is part one. Now, for part two, let's look at who's coming towards you for July month. Singles, brand new love. Ooh, Queen of Swords. You're going to receive some invitation. 
invitation okay who's coming towards leo brand new love please leo month sorry leo sign for the month of july who's coming towards leo july month singles please okay so leo five of wands okay king of wands the knight of swords and the wheel of fortune in reverse okay so i'm seeing two person leo uh, a love interest a love opportunity for some of you sorry this is someone from the past someone from the past you had argue with so they're coming back to you and um reinstate their access to your life okay i don't really feel about this person who's coming from the past although i need to you know i need to acknowledge that i get their energy in here okay so for some of you for brand new love um you were you will you have some competition i don't know sports if, if it's possible but there's some sort of competition or argument or competitiveness or miscommunication it is um specifically leo for leo female there's two person that you would meet or you would come across as love interest or love romantic one from the past very aggressive okay um it's it's not a good energy the 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 good energy is from the person who who you would initially have an argument with um so this is a person who's i think overseas or you talk to them in email or via phone and then for some of you it's a bank could be but i felt like what is that website um no, there's this website where you can see the it it display the work history link link and then link and then yeah. So for some of you, this is related to work. Um, it is. It's a it's a transaction. It's um it's a transaction. It's an appointment. It's something related where you need to follow up. Okay, you need to follow up. It's a transaction. It could be a sale. It, it could be anything that you need to follow up. And you would have some sort of a bit of um, sarcasm in the phone or maybe up face to face. And then you would remember their name. Okay. Their name is kind of unique or different. That um, it's either they will Google you in LinkedIn then or they will connect to you in some sort of networking. All right. So that's a love opportunity for you, brand new. It's um like for some of you in a crowd of people, in a crowd, you would notice them. Okay. The the next love opportunity, it will hit you that this person is interested with you or you're interested with them, is that their name. Their name sounds very unique. So instead of being upset or angry, you would kind of you would remember the name the name would make a mark maybe it's a mark but it will will hit you with it will you will find the 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 name unique or you will remember the name that's why you could be connecting in linkedin or a networking and um this is really good because um it's not the first time you would this is not the first transaction there would be there would be more of this i see this five times six times up until for some of you october month so for example you could be um because you you have a crush with this person you could be ordering the same you could be coming at the same shop or there would there's some sort of repetitiveness that you would do because you have a crush with this person okay you will kind of stalk them or they will stalk you it's this is the situation I'm getting in here, Leo. For example, uh, you 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 buying a coffee and you meet this barista and he or she is cute and the name is unique because there's a name tag, and then you keep going in there because of that person or you keep having the transaction because of that person or for some of you you would pretend to complain or query and you you ask them to be assigned to you or this person would take a survey and call you and because they like you something like that okay so i'm getting 50 50 you some of the leo friends that would watch you will be the one who initiate to see them again 
to contact them. For some of you, um, they will be the one who, when you, for example, you come inside the coffee shop, you would see them saying hi to you and doing your coffee, even though they're busy, they, they do yours, something like that. So be available, be on the eye, on the watch, uh, on the look, because this is really cute, okay? This brand new love. In While you are having this search for brand new love, there's also someone in the past. I don't like their energy, but I need to, you know, I need to really acknowledge that they're here. They're going to come back. Someone in the past. Someone who, someone from last year. Okay? So this is you. Thank you so much, Leo, for tuning in. Thanks for being here today. Thank you so much for supporting my channel. I hope you like the reading. If you do, don't forget to click like. Don't forget to click subscribe. And um, yeah, I'll see you in the weekly. Bye-bye.